This is Peden, a 39-year-old man from the Republic of Ireland, an avid video game fan and self-proclaimed hat collector, and above all else, a man who was obsessed with drifting. Although his childhood was relatively average, as he progressed into his teenage years and into his 20s, his mental decline was clear for all to see. A guy who was once a happy, vibrant child, with the world at his feet, has turned into a middle-aged man with no friends and a serious obsession. Uh, hi, my name is uh, Peden. Uh, I am a professional drifter uh, and I'm quite good at drifting. So did you say Christmas present from yourself? Yeah, yeah, it's from myself. Shall I open it? Will I open, would you like to? Surely you know what's in it. I mean, it shows what's in it. We don't know, so yeah. Shall I tear it? Well, I tear it. I, I, yeah, I tear it. Yeah. <sighs> I got racing boots and did you see them? Surprise you got these boots. After inheriting some money from relatives many years ago, Peden has spent thousands and thousands of euros on his own custom race outfits and personalised merchandise. So in here, this is the race room, right? So I have, you know, anything from suspension to brake discs and all the gear, right? Can we just see the outfits? The outfits kind of the main oh, impression that comes to This is the tracksido suit. This is the, the hoodie as well. I can put that on for you afterwards if you'd like. It has my name on the back. This, this is leopard print. It has my name on it as well. I have more stuff in here with my name on it, actually. You should see. I've got my steering wheel here uh, with my name on it. I have seats here. Look, they all have my name on it. That has my name on it. That was made by a machine. Do you want to see more? I have more. What's that suit there? Oh. Yeah, okay. So this is this is a new suit. I want to impress. I want to impress the guys, right? I want to impress the guys when we go drifting, so I made a special suit. Do you think they're going to like it? What do you think they're going to think of it? What they're going to think is the best thing ever. I, I, I really think they're going to love this suit. I can just tell it. I, it's going to work. Peden spends the majority of his time on his drift simulator perfecting his skills, as he puts it. This is why I'm so good at drifting, because I, I get to practice all the time, right? You know? Why did you change your hat? A drifting hat. That's not a drifting hat. I mean, this says drifting on it even. Have you seen it? It says drifting on it. You can put your drift shoes and everything like that. Well, I've got the boots on because I just got them for Christmas, you know? Who do you play against here? What's, what's going on here? So I'm playing, I'm playing online now, right? And this guy is from Norway and stupid Vikings. Look at this. Look at him taking that line. That's such a wrong line. So you play online a lot? All the time. I mean, all the time. I mean... Do you think this is why you're so good? Oh yeah, well I mean, well I mean, I was born, I was born with the gift of the drift. Look, he's, I mean, am I, yeah! No, just, just bring it in, bring it in! I'm, I'm in the middle, I nearly have... Fine, bring it in. Okay. Just, just, just eat it. You didn't bring, just where's my straw it. there? Where's my straw there? Just eat it. My, why do you insist on making just rye bread sandwiches? Eat Nobody eat. Nobody eats rye bread, Graham. Peden is unemployed and lives with his brother Graham in a small suburb of Cork. Graham has been the main constant in his life, turning from the younger brother into now effectively Peden's carer. Yeah, we're really hoping that uh, he'll play nice with all the other drifters, and and, and this should turn back around to, to being himself the way, he, the way he used to be before he got, I suppose, so in depth in, in himself with the drifting. You said the old him, so you, you didn't used to be like this. No, when he was when he was a child, like he was very friendly, outgoing, had loads of friends, um, and then I suppose the online gaming and the simulator came, and they all just faded away. Well, at least he's playing online. It must be nice to see him at least playing with people around the world on the drift simulator. No, no, he doesn't. There is no online people. He's just playing against himself. We had to turn that off months ago. Wait, he told us he was playing against the Norwegians. No, 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 no. We turned that off months ago because he was just going bananas from it. He was shouting, roaring. We had neighbours coming in thinking there was fights. Mr. Kittens, he, our little cat, he just went boom out the door. He just got rid of him. He was just, he's just, he's a lunatic over it. We were at our wits end over this. It just has to work. Down the street, down the street, down the street. Oh, look at him trying to cheat, look at him trying to cheat, look at him trying to cheat, look at him trying. What were you doing? What were you doing? Fucking no ages. Why did you do that for? Now I'm out of. Fucking no. No! 
No, get on the. Can you move? Sorry, excuse me. Can you just move back for a second, please? Fucking Norwegian, like. Graham! Graham, give me another apple juice! There might be hope for Peden yet. He has got wind of an exciting business based in Dublin called the Foundation for Lone Drifters. The organisation is run by CEO Gregory O'Neill, who founded the FFLD several years ago. My aim for the Foundation for Lone Drifters is to search Ireland and find the lone drifters and try to get them to, together, to drift together and get them going again. My son Rupert, he was drifting but uh, he drifted away from it. He's now a very successful businessman. He went to law school, graduated fast. He has a beautiful wife, two kids, big house, snooker room, the works. When he started work, he just drifted away completely from the drift and I could not get him back at it. It's a very sad story. It nearly tore our family apart. I never want to see another family go through what we went through with it. It might be too late for my son, but as long as I'm around, there won't be a lone drifter left in Ireland. Peden is off to Mandelo Park Race Circuit for a drift date with a few other drifters who also struggle in social drift situations. Is lads, you ready? Let's go to Dublin and let's go drifting. Graham, Graham, I'll see you later. I'm off to Dublin. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me know. Be nice, be a team player. Graham, shut Don't up be... and give me my drinks. Okay. Here's your cola. Yeah, yeah. Cream soda. Yeah, yeah. Box of water. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Don't ruin it. Hi right, lads, so here we are, we're at Killer's Auto Centre. Uh, this is where the guys work on the car, this is where the drift car stays all the time. They love this car. How are you getting on? The, the leads are here. How's the, how's the car? Is the, yeah. everything set up? Before we get any further, can I have a chat with you in the office here? Oh, no, let's just get the car down. The no, trailer's ready. No, 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 let's have a chat there first. There's something kind of pressing at the moment. We need to have a chat with you. Okay. Okay, just get you, you, we're, we're, we're starting suspension set up and stuff. We'll back in a minute. Just one minute, okay? There's a bit of an issue though, the payment. Oh, hold on, wait, wait, hold on, he's just, he's, let me just turn this off. I think that's off. Sorry, yeah, yeah, go on, yeah. Yeah, like, you know, it's four and a half grand. I'm looking at you, but, like, we do have to get sorted because, like, it's excuse after excuse after excuse, and... But, if we sort out next sick, you just pay the fucking bill. Okay, well, look, we'll call my brother. We'll call Graham. We'll call, we'll call, we'll call Graham right now and we'll sort it out. Dude, dude, look, the car's not leaving here until they get the money. Okay. After a minor hiccup, Peden is on his way to Mondello and his excitement is clearly building. Is he excited about today? <laughs> I can't. <laughs> and we're almost there as well. I, don't, I wonder who's going to be there. I wonder what they're like. I hope they can chase. You, you told them I, I, I do the leading. Like You have told them that, haven't you? Worry starts to set in as the obsession with leading seems to take over Peden's thoughts. You must just, I'll just be right back, okay? Now, that, let's go drifting. Does that bring you a good look? No, it's just, it's what you do, it's respect to the drift gods. As the other drifters start to arrive, Gregory and the other drivers anticipate the arrival of Peden, who is in the back of his van getting changed. Are you nearly ready because the guy from the foundation's out here? Yeah, yeah, no, I, I just, I'm just putting on my suit. Gregory is there for the initial meeting between the lone drifters. Peden's confidence seems to quickly turn to fear as the moment arrives for him to come face to face with the other guys. No, come on, come on, just not about it. They're good lads. Yeah, like, the light is you'll better like here. You like the them, you like them. I just, uh, hey. Hello, uh, Neil. Hi. 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 How are you? Hey, hi. But within seconds, he starts talking about himself and his hi, car. Okay. Have a look at my car. Have you, have you seen my car, lads? Have you seen this before, no? Nice car, yeah? I've noticed that you've brought some dull coloured cars, okay. so the, the yellow is bright, you see, so that it looks better that way, you see. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the doors, you can see through the doors. Have you seen this? You can see it. Yeah. Hello! After a slightly awkward introduction, the drift date officially begins. Things seem to start well with all the guys drifting all over each other around the track, with Peden leading the chase. I'm drifting with my new buddy! Oh, Peter! They're not even close to me. Come on, guys. It's going fantastic. I mean, when we got here this morning, you know, I kissed the starting line as a little bit of a homage, you know, to the drifting gods. We kind of, and I, we kind of meant with the guys that you're here. How do you mean, as in how I might? Be getting on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They love me. I think they love. I really think they love me. We've been doing a little bit of driving together. They've they followed me. They were saying maybe you've been leading a lot. Uh, that maybe they'll lead now and you can go in the chase position. No, no. But then they can't see me drift. 
Have you not been watching this at all? Did I go on the front and then they follow so they can see me drift, see how good I am. The fun soon starts to turn to anger for the others as they are unable to lead the drifting due to Peden's insistence that he be in front the whole time. Ah, uh, come on! Um, hey, yeah, definitely interesting. Uh, I've been overtaken a couple of times. He really, really likes to lead. Yeah. He talks about himself a lot and... Um, and there he is, look at him. Oh, he's waving at us now. So, uh, yeah, hello. Uh, okay, we'll be there, we'll be there now in one second. Uh, he's gonna lead, again. Local drift super fans who are often around the track to support their favorite drifters are also here today and are no stranger to Peden and his antics. He messages on Facebook, Instagram, kind of any sort of social media that he has yeah. his hands on. Like, he just Creep. continuously messages us, like, <laughs> and you're just like, I'm not responding, hoping he gets the, like, the idea, yes. but he never gets the idea. After what appeared to be a positive start, Peden's anger unfortunately starts to seep through as he gets annoyed that the other drifters keep overtaking him. Go behind me! Go behind me! Other drivers seem to be ignoring him and drifting without him. So in an interesting move, Peden decides to block the middle of the track and starts doing donuts. After 15 minutes of donuts, the other drifters have had enough and approach Gregory to talk about Peden's behaviour. Gregory, there's no talking to this dude. There is no talking to him. At one stage he came up to me talking about his race suit, talking about the cotton content of his race suit. Your man thinks it's as cool as a cucumber. I know, he just keeps passing us out. He won't, he, he just won't do anything with us. No, no, no he's, um, I'm sure he's a nice guy, but you can't deal with him. He's a dick. We're all over here, to be honest with you, Gregory. Nice to meet you. Sorry about that, but uh, good luck. All right, come on, let's get out of here. As the other drivers decide to leave, it's left to Gregory to inform Peden of the news that his drift date has prematurely come to an end. Sorry to tell you, Peden, but they have gone. It, you're out. They left. It's fine. I mean, no. I mean, it's okay. I really. I mean, I, I just drive on my own. I, I, it's much better with me. I, I, you know, it's much better on my own anyway. It's fine. Peter, can we just go? Can we just go? Yeah. I, I've, I'm going, just going drifting. We just, we heard the guys had to leave. We just wonder what happened. Oh, um, oh yeah, no, the guys, yeah, the guys had to leave. Um, yeah, what well, a car broke. But look, it doesn't. I mean, they, they weren't that great, really, to be honest. Um, they did not get a chance to see me drift, which is good. But uh, I, I'm going to keep. I'm going to keep drifting, okay? I have, there are some fans here somewhere, so I'm going to, I've sent them some messages. They haven't really read it yet. That's all right. We just wanted to know, ask you but, more about what happened, if that's all right. We oh, no, but look, I got to go drift. I got to go. We just came you were coming up this way. No, 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 but I got to go this, yeah. Can we, can we catch up later on? Just yeah, 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 yeah. Peden seems to take the news on the chin, and after a few minutes is back to drifting around the track, seemingly on phase that his actions have led to him driving alone once again. And so it seems, at this time, and for the foreseeable future, Peden will remain undriftable.